I like making women feel good. Mm. It feels good. <laughs> you know what I mean? It feels natural. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I need a sugar daddy, damn it. What the hell? So, tell us more. <laughs> Look. Tell us more. You hear how it don't hurt her voice to say it, though? Yeah, that's crazy. That that came from the song. No, no, no. no it, it sounds you can't, like baby, you, you can't. You, you just baby, retracted. I already, you yeah. retracted it. Mm -hmm. Woke up real quick. That's something that sugar daddy. Mm -hmm. mm. So basically, a nigga got to start tricking on you for you to really feel like it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got a part time one. I need to make him more full time. Wait, wait. Um, how y'all feel about tricking? It Trick ain't tricking if you got it. That's how I feel. It's not tricking if you got it. I I love for a nigga to trick off on me. I okay. And I like tricking off on niggas. Mm, that's good. I do. That's good. Returning the favor. I do. I that's like good. niggas that like me. <laughs> and let me know you show me you like me. Yeah. Cause then I'm a I'm a I'm I'm a reciprocate whatever energy you on. That's how I literally start every friendship, every relationship. I'm on whatever you on. Mm -hmm. I think that there's a misconception with the words tricking <laughs> and simping. You know what I mean? Like. Oh no, it's this, two totally different things. Right, but a lot of times people conflate the two. Like, there are some people who trick incorrectly. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then you end up being a simp. Like, don't go all out spending all kind of money for a woman that doesn't like you mm. or fake likes you. You know what I mean? But some people can't really tell that part, baby. And I'm that's sorry. That's where. I'm really good. That. <laughs> <laughs> that's where you gotta be P. You know what I mean? You gotta know, like, you got to be able to learn how to read women mm -hmm. and, you know, know for real what it is. Because, you know, there's been times like, I, you know, I met a, I met girls who might have just been tricked. And I think they maybe they was just there just just for the for the money or whatever. And what I'll money? play the game. <laughs> what money? Oh. No, I'm saying that they think that they was going to get though. Like Oh, you know, some, some girls just be begging. That yeah, and they do like that's the thing too. Um, I honestly have talked to guys that have money that are broke that mm -hmm. are in the middle. Mm -hmm. The most generous guys are broke. I know. Yeah, they they will give you their last. They, you they, their will, last. they will. They will do it. They yeah. trick and simp the hardest. Yeah, the niggas who are smart knows when to say no, and we'll see y'all later. And y'all get on my fucking nerves. No, we're smart. Like, no, 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 no. We're no. smart. What I will say too, no. Sometimes y'all not smart. Sometimes y'all are at the end of being dumb, and that's the part that that's the part that pisses me off. Sometimes with guys with money, they will get tired of tricking. Hmm. They will get tired of tricking. I don't know if their money is funny or they not liking the results that's coming behind the tricking. Or they found somebody that they could trick better with. Does the truth be told? It could be. It could just be that. It's just you know, I found another girl. No, 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 I'm talking about like, well, yeah, that could be a possibility, but mm -hmm. I'm saying like from like my perspective of like, if I first start talking to somebody, mm -hmm. I'm not necessarily going into it with the idea of wanting to be tricked on or whatever the case may be. I mean, I, we always want it. It's like always in the back of your mind, but it's never like in the front of my mind. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, sometimes they'll just get tired of tricking on girls. And then, and, and a lot of the times the ones that they're tricking on, the ones that have money, I'm speaking on, mm -hmm. the ones they're used to dating girls that don't have money. So they trick, 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 trick on these girls and they having the time and doing all of that. Then by the time you done done tricking on all these broke girls, mm -hmm. now you get you somebody that's doing okay and yeah. now you feel comfortable like mm -hmm. you don't got to. Mm -hmm. That is the strangest shit. Yeah, because I, I think um, when, when you do find a woman who she got some bread too and she start just buying you gifts and stuff like that, you know, depending on what you like, you know what I mean? I, I do I ain't like... I never just doing that, but... I, I mess with women just give me gifts. Like, you like shoes, what's your shoe size? I'm like, yo, if you can find my shoe size and get the shoes I want, then yeah, we, we can... we can, You can stick around. <laughs> like... It's easy. It's if she not, gonna spend it. If I she would, gonna spend it. It's, you can find it, baby. I if I you like shoes... 14 and 15 and some shoes. Mm -hmm. like, that shoe's hard to find. So... No, it's expensive. It's easy to find. It's expensive. Yeah. You're gonna find it. Sometimes. Is you gonna pay it? Yeah. That Is you too. gonna pay it? Yeah, because like, you can go on websites and list the shoe you want, and people can sell it to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I mean, I I, I like it when I when did that before. That's why I know. See? <laughs> See, you're a good one. You ain't a broke. You ain't a broke girl. You know what I mean? But yeah, 
Um, I, I think for men who actually have money um, in abundance and they just like making their women feel good, I like making women feel good. Mm. It feels good. <laughs> you know what I mean? It feels natural. You Same thing I mean? for us, though. Yeah, because you I guys... Swear, I love to give You gifts. guys naturally give back. Like, you guys already want to give. You guys want to do that. You just want to do it for the right guy. And That's just the part. Finding the right guy, knowing which one's the right guy or not. That's mm-hmm. it. So. Most definitely. Yeah. Shout out shout out to all the good women, man. Appreciate y'all. I can't wait to find me a guy I can trick on. Hey, young. Hey, young. <laughs> now, it's been years. Oh, my God. Um, let us know in the comments. Have you tricked before? What are your opinions on tricking? Leave it in the comments below. When you first start talking to someone, well, you a man, Krista. When you first start talking to somebody, right, <laughs> and their birthday comes up first. Ooh, that's a good one. And y'all been talking less than a year, of course, because this is the first go round. Oh, how man. do you gauge how you purchase that gift? Even for you, I think that's probably a little bit. That's a really good question, actually. When when is the trial period in? Like, okay, we talking for long enough. Should I get? Like, how do you gauge what to buy? So you get them something or you do something like if it's very very early at minimum a decent dinner i i do so for me i would do like simple stuff you know what i mean like because most of the time it really is the thought that counts like especially if you're talking to a good girl who's not like into like all the materialistic things and all that kind of stuff like i remember i just sent um this one girl some candles you know what i mean like, okay. she really really appreciate how long that. were y'all talking though we were talking, this was probably like three months, three, four months, something okay. like that. So it was very, very early. So, you know, I just get, I got her some therapeutic candles, you know what I mean? She'd be stressed out. Like, yo, go ahead, do this. And, you know I mean, she really appreciated that. You know what I mean? That was dope. Mm-hmm. So, you know, like little stuff, you know what I mean? Like, don't go out your way. Be like, you know, especially if y'all haven't made it official yet. You know? What kind of gifts have you gotten when your birthday comes up first? Shoes, trips concerts stuff that i like okay you know what i mean like i ain't gonna lie like one of the best gifts for like going to a concert like i went by myself mm-hmm. and um i had amazing tickets i got to meet the artist mm. um that was a great great gift that was a great gift what about you what was the best gift you uh, ever received in a relationship the best gift mm-hmm. i ever received mm-hmm. from somebody you was talking to or dated what is the best gift? I, I know your jewelry. love language is gift giving. Is uh, gift um, I realize I actually don't think that's my love language. I don't oh, think really? that's my problem. I think it's like secondary. I think it's um acts of service for me. Okay. Which to me feels like gifts. It's the same thing. Because mm-hmm. it doesn't have to be something physically handed to you. It can just be mm-hmm. you did something for you me. You did something for me. Gotcha. Crystal. Make my life easier. Top hill, top hill, top.